Yo, what's up guys? Dante here, back with another episode of NCAA 06 Rivalry Mode. We are here on Season 2, Episode... Uh, let's see... We are Episode 6 of the Rivalry Series. So essentially, how it goes, I'll play a rival game, we'll play overtime rules on Heisman, of course, we win the game, win the trophy. Now, obviously, with Season 2, it's a little different. We're playing with uh, the FCS schools, so they don't have official trophies, but certain games do have, you know, actual titles. So, for example, today's episode, we'll be doing the Southern Conference, and as you see on the top, first game we'll be doing is Battle for the Old Mountain Jug, which is Western Carolina and Appalachian State. Um, so, essentially, how this works... Um, I always play as a team that is losing the series on the road. So as you can see, Appalachian State is destroying this series at this point in 2005. So I will be Western Carolina. We will be going to Appalachian State. And yeah, we're gonna go in there, I hope we win. Uh, just generic white and purple. It looks like they got like the Wolverine type design. I think, I can't really tell. Well, let's go ahead and get into it. Oh, nice. Okay, cool. This may be the best rivalry you've never heard of. Appalachian State and Western Carolina first played back in 1932. But it wasn't until 1976 that the two schools played for the 25-pound moonshine jug painted in gold. Every year, these two teams battle with the gloves off for the old mountain jug. All right. As you can see, Western Carolina has two wins in the last eight. Let's get into it. Tails never fails. And we are going on offense. And yeah, let's get into this. See if we can win this. Uh, so they're wanting the West Coast. Um, let's, go, let's go play action corner. Let's see if we can score right now. We've got two impact receivers. I think we can score. And just like that, we are on the board. Okay, so it's not the, the Michigan type helmet, but it's just at the two long stripes. But anyway, very good throw, good route. That ball was kind of ugly. Before we move on, let's go ahead and try to get a thumbnail out of this guy. So this ball should have gone. <laughs> Should have gone to the corner. Uh, as you can see, I'm, I'm running toward the pylon. I have to come back in and kind of jump and get that. And that was just, that ball is so ugly. Was it ugly? I don't know, that's a good throw. Just weird, I, just a weird mechanic. I don't know, it just looks weird. extra point and then we will go on defense and we can go ahead and try to win this game nice All right. well the offense did their part now it's time for the defense to take over and this is a very high pressure situation for an offense to face if you don't score a touchdown Ah, oh, come on, Burgess. Oh, man. Alright, so. We heard their quarterback. Um, I really don't know what we're working with. But, uh, yeah. It's unfortunate, but that's part of the game. That's part of football. Oh, get the ball, get the ball, get the ball, go. 
Uh, oh, get the ball, get the ball, get the ball, get the ball. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Double fumble. Nice. Well, that rain helped us out there. Number 99. Big man. Oh, what a hit. Yeah, so 15 recovered it. He wasn't ready for the moment. That moment was too big for him. All right. And that is the battle for the old mountain jug. Goes to Western Carolina. And that'll bring this tiebreaker to an end. Kirk, any final thoughts here? All right. Good, good. That was light work. Wasn't a... Uh... Oh, I just noticed what's on their helmet. It's like a... Uh... It's got like the cat eyes, instead of the cat. That's actually pretty good at custom customization for FCS school. That's like a very unique detail. I like that, I like that. All right, nice. Let's get on out of here. And then we will move on uh, to the next robbery game. So now we're moving on to the second game in our uh, episode it will be Furman versus the Citadel uh, the battle for the silver shack sh shackle I think that's what that is I don't know what that means a shackle a shakun I guess shackle I don't know uh, Furman leaves the series so it will be the Citadel on the road and yeah, let's go ahead and get this W. Nice. We won the toss. All right, defense first. I always play defense when you play overtime. So I won't know what their playbook is until until we uh, get on offense. So I guess it's just a bunch of heavy formations. Oh my God. That that's ridiculous. Okay. He just, uh, he just, he just bodied him. Boom. Nice. All right. So I think, I'm thinking we may have to go for two. I don't. Oh, so they got some shotgun. So why is it called balance run? I guess it's just a very balanced playbook, I guess. I don't know. Because they also have balanced pass as a playbook. So I don't, I don't, I guess, I don't know what the difference is, really. I'm about to look that up. Yes, sir. Beautiful, beautiful. That was clean. Perfect ball, perfect placement. Hold on, let me. That may be the thumbnail of the video. Let's see. That's how you go for the ball. Catch at its highest point. That's a good job, Williams. Good job. All right, we're going for two. We're going to end this now. Uh, speed option. All right, we got, I think we might have. We spread them out. Six point. He is fast. Good God. And that game set and match, gentlemen. So that right there is the battle for the silver shako. Goes to the Citadel. Alright, nice. So this is 
this one is a, a little bit more of a quicker episode. Um, we did what we had to do, got the victory. Nice, short, and sweet. And uh, yeah, that will be the end of this episode. So as always, uh, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.